Well, hey there, everybody. Welcome. Welcome to my booth. I'm Jay. Today's sample, it comes to us from Shayla. And so we're going to give it a listen, see what we can come up with to help her out here. Some really great copy, really great interpretations of said copy. I'm excited to get into it. Before we do, if you'd like me to review audio of yours, you know what? There's a form. It's in the description of this video, as well as many other videos just like this one on the internet and this chat anyway fill it out send me something and we'll put you in a video like this one as soon as i can with that said shayla what you got for us what if potential had no limits what if you could explore hidden patterns in your world instantly hidden patterns that unlock endless possibilities with your data and neo 4j graph potential is boundless no rows no columns just relationships. Billions of them. Change your world with Neo 4J. Mm -hmm. It's a really cool spot, really cool copy. As I said, Shayla, you're doing a great job. And I listened to the rest of your spots. And you've got a good handle on a lot of stuff. So I'm going to be a little bit uh, more critical. Just saying that up front. So for this spot... There are a couple things that I want to talk about. Firstly, uh, the volume of everything in just looking at the waveforms, you can hear it if you're listening to it, but your, uh, to my, in my opinion, at least, uh, your voiceover, you should add a little bit of compression, I think, uh, to put it over the music and turn the volume up. Right now, this is your voiceover is just a little too quiet relative to everything else. I'm not going to fiddle with it right now. And I've got other videos on this channel talking about just that. Let me know if you have questions. Uh, so that's on the technical side of things. Um, another thing, technically, I'm not sure if you put this demo together yourself. If you did, a really, really small thing, this bit. Hidden patterns that unlock endless possibilities. The There's a change in music underneath this line here. And whenever there's a change in music in short little snippets of uh, music like this in an ad, it's really great if you can sync it up with speech. And it's really close. And I just point it out as something to think about for you, Shayla, and anybody else who's making their demos. I'm going to play this again and just listen to this sh for the shift in music. Hidden patterns that unlock endless possible. Hidden patterns that unlock a... And then it goes into this other section. Patterns in your world. Instantly. Hidden patterns that unlock endless possibilities. Hidden patterns that unlock endless possibilities. It'd be nice if you could uh, key things up to those shifts in music, at least in my artistic opinion. And that's a great opportunity. And you're very, very close, which is why I pointed out, because that line is a sort of shift and a um what's the word it's a sort of revelation for this company's product hidden patterns show a uh, endless possibilities um and you can just help us with the understanding with those little tiny artistic choices and to that end in this spot uh, admittedly, it took me a couple listens before I really discerned what the company's product was about. Um, and what that tells me, Shayla, is you're nailing the tone of this copy. It's like mysterious, somewhat sophisticated. Uh, I trust you. It sounds kind of like a sexy product, like it's going to make things... Uh, or service, whatever this is, that really helps us and it does it in a really elegant and cool way. Uh, the music helps with that sort of vibe as well. But there are certain... Um, I, I, I'm missing the gist of why this is important. So you're nailing the tone, but you could do better at serving up for us uh, exactly what is different about this product. And that'll somewhat help here with the hidden patterns that unlock endless possibilities. Hidden patterns that unlock 
endless possibilities. And I don't want, that's not a line reading, I don't want you to do it like me, but little things like that, hidden patterns that unlock endless possibilities. Because what I gather from the copy is this company, they're sort of like a data interpretation firm or software or whatever, that they take data and they break it down so it's easy for you, the business owner, to understand all of these possibilities and relationships. And I, I think that uh, if you just help us a little bit to understand that, um, it'll take this to the next level. Because as I said, you're nailing the tone of it. Let's hop to the next one. Slide into your experience with Durax Lubes. Help sex feel better. Try Durax Lubes. Okay. Uh, obviously, again, nailing the tone nailing it it flows really nicely your quality of voice is perfect for this uh it's really gentle seductive uh sensual the list goes on so really really nice in all of those respects now this may be somewhat of a personal taste thing a directorial choice thing if i were directing you in this ad you for my money are so darn close and what i would suggest is for a product like this specifically we all get it we're all on the same page here and so you don't have to hit the nail on the head really you kind of can just wink at us if you want and Hitting the word, what I really am coming down to is slide into your experience. When you hammer the word slide for a lube, it uh, it just conjures up all sorts of images and stuff. And it's a really nice play on that. And I'm sure that's what they're uh, honing in on. But we're going to get it without you necessarily giving us that much on it. Um so you can leave a little bit more to the imagination if you wish. Slide into your experience with Durex Lube. Uh, and that would just be my, my small adjustment. You can do exactly what you just did, but with a little bit more of a, a shoulder shrug instead of, um, you know, just, just bring it down to a really, really small gesture. Something that pulls us in, but... Uh, it doesn't have to lay everything out for us, if that makes sense. Let's hop to the next. Now you can get a shoe that has it all. Our softest, most responsive shoe yet. Thanks to our nitrogen-infused DNA tune technology, runners get the best of both worlds. Larger cells for soft landings. Smaller cells for responsive toe-offs. Plus, our expertly crafted Glide Roll Rocker provides effortless heel-to-toe transitions. The result is nothing short of the latest game-changing innovation. Mm-hmm. Let me check something real quick. 30 seconds on the nose. Awesome. Yeah, I was going to say my, my inclination, or I was sort of, eh, maybe, I... I was hedging towards, I think maybe you could go faster, but you're 30 seconds on the nose, which is what this kind of a spot would be. As far as this being a part of your demo, I say it whenever uh, someone submits a full demo sample sort of like this, um, but we understand what this tone of this thing is, what the nature of it is, and voiceover demos by and large are to demonstrate uh, what you can do, what your voice is capable of, what kind of products and uh, environments suit you. And we can pick up on that pretty cleanly, so uh, in very brief amounts of time. So as far as a full example of what you can do, this is great as part of a uh, like collage of your talents and abilities. Uh, you could probably trim this down and we'll get the we'll get the idea pretty quickly. I would never go over like 15 seconds in a compilation demo like this. That said, this is a pretty well done spot. There There is a bit of me that thinks that you could maybe um, pull back a little bit and not hit things on, hit the nail on the head so much. What I mean by that is... Um, now you can get a shoe that has it all. Our softest, most responsive shoe yet. 
our softest, most responsive shoe yet. Like you can embody your energy on it and interpretation of what it should be is spot on. And you can just like internalize it a little bit more. If maybe that's a better way to put it. Uh, our softest, most responsive shoe yet. Uh, instead of our softest, most responsive shoe yet. Our softest, more response. It's a, it's, it's a very small difference. And I, as I said at the beginning, you're doing such a bang up job already that I'm going to be pretty, pretty uh, sharply critical here. Uh, let, let me listen to the end of this one one more time. Plus, our expertly crafted glide roll rocker. Yeah, that's another thing. Our expertly crafted glide roll rocker. When you put that sort of effort in and when it's like a hard sell on a feature of something like that, again, this may be just a taste thing again but uh i it's like a subconscious thing where if someone says no i'm really good at cooking spaghetti then you're like well are you though do you need to like sell me that hard on your abilities to do this and so with a product or shoe like this it's like no this is this this technology full stop is the is a game changer for athletes and runners and get ready ladies and gems gents uh and i think that that's another way to sort of break down why the hard sell versus the sort of embodying and suggesting thing is a little bit better this last spot shayla was my favorite of yours let's give it a listen you spend a lot of time with your monitor working gaming learning sometimes even hours live streaming video buying the right monitor is like finding your perfect match your number one do you see what I mean? You're not selling me on any of this. You're not trying to make it sexy. It's like already I'm leaning in this ad, uh, your performance of this ad. I'm like, what the hell is this monitor? Because it's, um, I don't know. It's just like, I, I, it's great. It's really great. I'm starting from the beginning. It's so great. You spend a lot of time with your monitor, working, gaming, learning, sometimes even hours live streaming video. Buying the right monitor is like finding your perfect match, your number one. What? There's another thing. That's an ex excellent example of where a shift in the music helps so, so much in this ad. And it's really, really well placed, really, really well done. Buying the right monitor is like finding your perfect match, your number one. What features are you looking for? Easy on the eyes? Check. Cares about the planet? We got that too. Style? Done. It's time to turn heads with a trusted and reliable monitor. The world's favorite monitor. A perfect fit for you. Yeah. It's awesome. It's awesome. I have very few, if no notes on this one. The only part that I'm a little... Uh, if I were directing you in this for like an actual commercial, I might hone in on this middle set. I can't remember where it was. I'm sorry. Your number one. What features are you looking for? Ah, what features are you looking for? That question to me in listening to it, I'm unsure if you're asking me specifically because you should be. You should be asking, hey, you. You're probably in front of your monitor a lot. What features are you looking for? Do you want it this, this, or this? And uh, I just, the, the way it's done, it seems a little bit removed and even somewhat rhetorical almost. I'm not going to nitpick. I just think, ask this question more directly to the exact person you're talking to. What features are you looking for? Easy on the eyes? Check. Cares about the planet? We got that too. Style? done yeah i love it i love that last spot so much that i'm inclined to say i would maybe even recommend making this the first in your demo if you're going to make this a full compilation demo uh just because it's really great it's really wonderful i'm going to listen to the first one again just to be sure that i want to make that recommendation give me one moment what if potential had no limits what if you could explore hidden patterns in your world instantly? Hidden patterns that unlock endless... Oh, I don't know. I think if you brought the sort of conversational uh, quality, this isn't to say that the first one isn't conversational, but the same sort of 
uh, groundedness. I mean, I belabored the point at the first spot how um, you were nailing the tone and I feel like it could be a little bit more grounded and centered. Uh, but the last spot, you have just such a detectable and beautiful humanity to it that if you brought more of that to the first spot i think the first spot is great because it has that um the sort of drive and power to it where this uh, this last one is sort of laid back they're both really wonderful the whole thing's really wonderful shayla uh really really great job and uh, i hope that some of those points and tips were helpful for you uh, if you have any questions, let me know. And for the rest of you, I hope it was helpful too. If you have any questions about this, anything else voiceover related, hey, I'm here. Ask me questions. And if you want to support us, there are buttons down there. Click them in the description. There are other ways to support the channel if you're feeling particularly generous. Until the next one of these, my friends, be well. And I'll see you then. Toodles. Toodles.